In this animation, we'll be working with the analog I.O. modules available in the PLC Logic simulation software package. We'll begin our examination by taking a look at the basic I.O. simulator. Our focus will be on the analog I.O. interface consisting of the input module in slot 7 and the output module in slot 8. The basic I.O. simulator provides one slider for each of the four input channels in Module 7. Similarly, a digital display is provided for each of the four channels in the Slot 8 output module. Each available channel in the input and output modules is intended for use as a specific purpose, input or output. Channel 0 is used for voltage, channel 1 for current, channel 2 for resistance, and lastly channel 3 is used for temperature. Each of the four channels associated with both the input and output modules is configurable. This allows the user to define parameters such as range, offset, and value scaling. We'll now move on and use a practical example to illustrate how the I.O. is configured. We will configure the slot 8 channel 0 analog voltage output module to provide an output voltage range of 0 to 10 volts when values ranging from 0 to 5000 are sent to it. We will use a simple ramp voltage application to demonstrate the desired behavior. We'll begin by taking a brief look at our ramp voltage application. In this application a counter is being incremented every 500 milliseconds. The accumulated value of the counter is being multiplied by 50 and sent directly to the slot 8 output module. As the preset value for the counter is set to 100, this will provide the value range of 0 to 5000 being sent to our analog output channel 0 location. We have added rung 4 to the application allowing for the value being sent to the analog voltage module to be displayed on the slot 6 BCD output display. As can be seen here, the analog voltage module tag is an alias for our slot 8 channel 0 output location. This location will receive values from 0 to 5000 and translate them to output voltages between 0 and 10 volts. The BCD display tag is an alias for the slot 6 BCD output display. As can be seen on rung 4, we are sending the value stored in the analog voltage module location to the BCD display so that it can be displayed along with the actual voltage coming from the slot 8 channel 0 location. We'll now move on and configure the slot 8 channel 0 output location to meet our requirements. Under our I.O. configuration heading, we right-click on the Slot 8 module name. We then click on Properties from the drop-down menu to bring up the dialog box. First, we select Channel 0 as the output channel to configure. Next, we specify the desired output range. As it happens, our desired range matches the default setting of 0 to 10 volts. Other ranges are available and can be selected by clicking on the drop-down arrow. We now move on to define the output scaling. The high and low signal values represent the actual voltage that will appear at the terminals of the channel 0 slot 8 output location. The high and low engineering values represent the value range that is being sent to that output location from the PLC application. To complete the configuration, we simply enter the upper and lower limits of the values we are sending to the slot 8 location. These limits get specified in the high and low engineering fields. Lastly, we click on the OK button to complete the configuration. We can now bring up the basic I.O. simulator and place the application online to demonstrate the desired behavior. During the simulation, you can view the raw data being sent to the output location on the slot 6 BCD display. You can see the corresponding voltage that results from these values shown on the channel 0 slot 8 analog voltage output meter.